in the back. It's as close as it can get, yet I still got room even back here. And that's not supposed to be like that. It's supposed to be completely closed in the back so I can get my upper, upper body some support. But the beautiful thing about this is that it fits me perfectly here. But what happens if I lose weight? What happens if I have to go smaller? What do you do? Do you just exchange it? Do you, do you buy another corset? I mean, I have two more brand new ones, the same exact size from corset deal, and I'm afraid I'm going to have the same issues that I'm having now. You know, so I may have to just, you know, wear my wear my um uh wear my under bust because it's still got room in there for me to adjust and it's a 28 so it's same same size 28 too loose for over bust but just right enough to train smaller for an under bust i don't get it um i'll put the the, the description of the model of this particular corset um this is the little jacket that it came with. Um, I personally like the aestheticness of the jacket, but I don't like the fact that it doesn't cover here all the way. And I don't like the fact, sorry of course that deal, um, that there's not enough eyelets in here to completely close all the way for us smaller titted women, okay? We're not these big huge porno stars, you know what I mean? Or we're not blessed with beautiful big ass tits. There's some, there's some corsetters on YouTube that got the most prettiest tits for these type of things and for us smaller booby people, we can't wear it. And then the other thing about corset deal is I don't like the angle of where the under, where the, uh, 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 where the pit goes in at. And then about this corset, it needs to be taken in a few inches at the top, okay? Or you need to advise us if you are an A cup or a B cup, subtract two more sizes or three more or four more sizes. But there's no more advisory and according to um, your sizing chart, it said the same, the same size around and then subtract four to six inches. So I did subtract six inches. I was actually a 30, um, around here I was a 34. So I subtracted six inches and I got me a 28. And then you tell us about our over bust ones. We have to measure from here to here. And I did, and it's the exact same. And guess what? It's still not fitting me properly and I don't know how to go about it. So, I mean, this is my review of this corset. I love, I, okay. One thing I do love the aestheticness of this. This is like one of my favorite looking over bust corsets. I mean, it's beautiful, okay? I mean, I would still wear it, but I would have to wear it with a shirt. And I was actually hoping someday to wear it without a shirt. So, say for example, I get a boyfriend or I get a date or I finally uh, get intimate. I have something of, you know, something of the quality of the interaction that I want to wear when I get ready to do that type of thing. But this is what it looks like on the side. This over here. It's really, really loose in here, all the way around the top. Perfect from here down, okay? But not from here up. So anybody else has gone through this type of thing, you know, where you're small breasted or maybe even you're big breasted and you've had the same issue. How did you solve it? You know, I'm not going to stuff my, I'm not going to stuff my, my tits, you know, and make them look bigger so I fill out this way so the material will stretch this way. I mean, it'd be fine if my titties were way out to here, but, but fortunately and not fortunately, I don't have these big tits to fill this top section. And then this other section I'm going to have an issue with soon because it's completely closed in the back. There's no room to grow. There's no room to, to side cinch. Okay, this is Alicia Joy giving you my review of this corset. I'll give the exact description of it in, in the description of this video. Um, 
later. It's, I actually have my transaction history ready to go for you guys. Um, I may do another review of the other corsets that I've got, but they take forever to put on. And this one was a pain in the ass to tie because the strings are so dang long. Okay? Anyways, Alicia Joya, thank you guys for watching. Have a great day.